in this video we are going to talk about uh, a summer 23 release feature that's made uh, generally available so this feature helps us to define a field level security on permission sets so this was introduced in winter 23 as a beta and now in summer 23 release uh, this, is, this has been made generally available so typically when you want to set the security in salesforce we use uh, profiles and permission sets right the combination so especially when it comes to setting a setting a security for a field uh, uh, right now uh, we, we we use when, when the field is created uh, we have the option you know where the where the system will show the list of uh, profiles isn't it so we can define that using we can define a field level security at a profile level but this functionality is going to change that and this is going to help us to you know follow the best practice in the way how a, a security uh, can be configured in Salesforce. So uh, typically to avoid uh, multiple profiles uh, from getting created just for the purpose of uh, securing your, or defining, configuring security for your org, uh, we can use permission sets and in a nice way we can configure the field level security. Yeah. So now let's see the current uh, way how a field led security is handled then we'll talk about how this functionality can be enabled and how it changes the way how security is handled for a field in salesforce so i'm in the account object and i'm gonna uh, look for a custom field uh, let's say this is my custom field payment partner gate so again i just pick any field you know not a custom or not standard so any field for that matter so while you are in that field you can just see set field level security option right so this is what we typically do so i go to set field level security and what i see is the list of profiles so now i can just say whether this profile you know can see this particular field or not this profile users or should i want to make this read only for this users i can do it here right here isn't it so this is what going to be changed when you use this particular functionality right so to enable this functionality by default it is not enabled you have to go to this uh, setup again you have to search for uh, user management and settings so when you are in user management settings uh, right below you have an option which helps you to turn on this feature so right now this is disabled i'm going to just turn it on perfect now this this functionality has just been turned on so what i'm going to do is i'm going to um, duplicate this I'm going to go to the same screen, go to the field account, go to fields and relationships. Let me look for that field, which I showed you just a few moments, a few moments ago, partner payment type. I'm going to go to set field level security. And now you can just see this right earlier. We were just, uh, we were just, uh, we, we, we did see the list of profiles right now. What you are seeing is, you know, all the permission sets especially the permission sets that has access to you know where the where account read is configured so you can also see the other permission sets as well you can just see this right here yeah so <coughs> basically now instead of instead of you know defining a field level security at a profile level i can define it at a at a permission set level see earlier again you know we can we can we can still uh, using that earlier method i can just uh, if you want to configure the field level security uh, inside a permission set i have to go to that permission set isn't it i have to go to the permission set and then i have to go to the object uh, settings then i have to pick the particular object and then i have to edit this right and then i can define the field level security right here so this is how traditionally that right, we have been doing things correct but think about it so i have to repeat this you know for every permission set isn't it let's say i have 10 permission sets and i want to configure this particular field access right uh, for in all the 10 permission sets manually i have to go to each and every permission set and then do it instead instead what we have now is with this new functionality i can able to still you know i can able to use the set field level security option and then i can just simply configure the access right here when i click on save automatically all these permission sets right will get updated you know or will get will have this uh, read access enabled for this particular field so this way i can able to you know define a field level security on permission sets okay so that's this new feature is all about yeah 
So this is going to help us to define permission set on permission sets instead of profile. And also you can add it to the recommended methods, right? Uh, by implementing field level security through permission sets, isn't it? So that's the feature called uh, FLS on permission set.